Alright, so today I'm totally stoked. It was raining outside, I couldn't finish the one project I really wanted to do. I did a different project. This one's been in the works for quite some time. It's this guy right here. Whoop! See that? Most of you just think, oh, yeah, cool, it's a, a Nintendo controller. Uh, no, this isn't just a Nintendo controller. Hold down the uh, start button, because that's how you start it. Hold down for a few seconds. Bam! The Nintendo logo right there. The little R turns an LED on. Now, that's not so cool, just an LED. Who cares? Well, this bad boy right here, see that? Wanna hit start? That's right, folks. This is an MP3 player. There's a few people out there making them on the internet. A lot of them use like extra parts and stuff, but uh, I didn't. I use the actual circuit board on the inside of this controller. Right now I don't have these buttons doing anything, but um, the start is to start the songs and to pause them, and it's also the on and off button. Um, select doesn't do anything. I'm probably gonna change that to a track select, like a forward and back button. Um, and probably one of these to another to the same thing as the start. Uh, right here, you've got volume up. Whoa, loud! Woo! And you got the volume down. Nice and quiet. To put the track going back, whoop, skip back to the last track that I was on. This is forward. Just click it to go forward, it goes forward. So you've got volume up, volume down, track back, and track forward. Hold this down, it rewinds back. Hold this down, it fast forwards. This is what I do when I finish a project like this. Um, I'm just like, woo, totally stoked. So I do this. Cause now it's Judy's turn to cry. Something you said I just died